Hi everyone and welcome to Miss Estric Biology. In this video I'm going to be going through mitosis for GCSE Biology. If you are new here then click subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the latest videos. So have you ever found yourself wondering how new skin cells are made to heal a cut or how an embryo goes from being just a ball of cells to a fetus? How your fingernails grow or how plant roots grow? Well if you have the answer to all of those is mitosis and that's what we're going to be going through today so one type of cell division is mitosis and it's really important for growth and development of multicellular organisms like plants and animals new cells that are grown must be identical to the original if they're going to be replacing or adding to the existing cells and that's so that these new cells also perform exactly the same function. Now, when we say identical, we're meaning genetically identical. And genetically identical means that inside of the nucleus, they have exactly the same DNA. So the same chromosomes with the same genes and alleles on them. The cell cycle is split into three key stages. And within the cell cycle, the DNA doubles and then the cell divides. And that is how we get these two identical cells. So the three stages. The first one is the cell has to grow. If that cell is going to split in half to make new cells, then it has to grow first of all, so that every cell doesn't become smaller and smaller and smaller. So that's what we have as one of the main stages of the cell cycle. The cell gets bigger, and all of the organelles, which are the internal cell structures, they also replicate. So things like the ribosomes and the mitochondria. As well as that, all of the DNA doubles. So DNA replication happens. So there's now two copies of every single chromosome. And that is so that when the cell does split in half, both of the new cells have the correct number of each chromosome which in humans is 23 pairs or 46 in total. The last stage is the actual cell divides. So we have the cytoplasm splits and the cell membrane splits, and that is how we get our two new cells. So this is just showing you some of those stages. This cell has already gone through the first two steps, the cell growth and the DNA replication. And then we can see that the cytoplasm is starting to pinch inwards and starting to split, as is the cell membrane just here, until eventually it does split and we now have two identical cells to each other. And they're also identical to the original cell that they're both made from. So where does mitosis occur? It happens in nearly all of your body cells. In fact, the only body cells that it doesn't happen in are the sex cells. So that would be your gametes. Um, that is where we don't have occurring when we're making gametes. It does happen in particular in the root tips of dividing plants. And that's what we can see here. This is a root tip from a plant under the microscope. And at the very tip, that is where mitosis is happening. So the roots can continue to grow in length and reach lots of water. Another example is in humans when embryos are growing. So here we have the first cell that'd be a zygote after a sperm and egg fuse. And all of these new cells that are doubling and replicating, that is by mitosis. Now, sometimes mitosis does go wrong. Usually mitosis happens absolutely as it should because there are controls in place to make sure that your cells are replicating only when you need new cells and at a speed that is appropriate. However, sometimes those controls stop working and that will then mean that a cell can divide uncontrollably by mitosis and you end up with far more cells than you actually need. And that is what a tumor is. It's a group of cells that have been created by this uncontrollable division. Now, some tumors are benign, which means they're not cancerous. Some are malignant, which means they are cancerous. And there's another video on that later on in the GCSE topic. So that is it for mitosis. I hope you found it helpful. If you have, then make sure you give this video a thumbs up. 